The first semi-final of FIFA Women's World Cup 2019 was a great game between USA and England. There are so many good things to say about both of the teams, but in this video we're going to focus on Carly Telford, English goalkeeper, who has left her heart on that pitch today. And because there were a few one-to-one -one situations during this game, I want to give you a full drill that you can add to your training. So make sure to stick around till the end. Hi there, Master Gully. Welcome to another analysis video from the FIFA Women's World Cup 2019. And in this video, we're going to analyze the performance of Carly Telford. My name is Claudia Kowalska, I'm the FA goalkeeper coach and I'm the goalkeeper myself for over 15 years now and I'm passionate about helping you becoming better goalkeeper by sharing the knowledge and skills you need to get yourself to the next level. So this is a World Cup series but we also do a lot of training tips videos on this channel and you can watch a few by clicking the tab right here and I'll put links in the description below. And if you're new to this channel, please consider subscribing. So moving on to Carly Telford. She's been tested right at the beginning of the game in the fourth minute where she had to do a reaction save and she makes the save. However, I do have a little problem with this one because the ball was going straight into her hands. And whenever that happens, you should always try to catch the ball because when you catch it, you have the possession of the ball. And what she did was she spit the ball in front of her in the middle and thankfully defenders have cleared the ball away. You should always remember that if there is a need to parry the ball, you need to parry it to the side instead of in the middle. Five minutes later, unfortunately for England, USA gets a free header, there was no defender marking the player and she just used this opportunity very well scoring the goal. I understand those type of balls are very fast and of course you need to react very very quick and she almost got a hand on that ball and it's so so important that you watch the ball all the way till the end until it's safe. And I've said it before, I know, but sometimes we don't realize how important watching the ball is. When we're looking at the ball, we can adjust our actions. And sometimes such a small thing as that can lead another team to a victory. Then make a really good save, very strong and firm hands. And this time she parried the ball to the side where there were no opponents. She has handled the pressure really well a few times but then there was a really weak pass back to her defender that could have ended with a goal for USA. Before we'll get to the second goal for USA, I want to know what's your opinion on this game and who do you think is going to win the entire World Cup? Let me know in the comments below. During that goal, Telford had a really good movement towards the ball but we can see that at one point she hesitated either to come out more or stay where she was and that is the exact moment England concedes the goal. Again, she almost had a hand on that ball and that time that she hesitated, she could have used to react faster and that could end a lot differently for England. You really need to trust your own decisions and when you decide on something, you have to commit to it 100% and this is exactly what you're going to learn from the drill coming up now. breakdown of 1v1 breakaways just click the screen now or for another video from Master Golly just click the screen right now. 
Don't forget to subscribe for more videos helping you become a better goalkeeper and I can't wait to see you in the next one.